Hi, welcome to CheesyCode.com. Today we are going to learn different JavaScript hacks that we can use in our coding. I will be explaining four different JavaScript hacks. First one, variable null check. Second, using string variables in arithmetic operations. Third, setting default value to a variable. Fourth, ternary operator. We are going to start with variable null check. This is my developer console of Chrome. I will be assigning a value to a dummy variable. As you can see, I am assigning a blank value to dummy variable. Usually people put this condition to check whether the variable has a value or not. As you can see here, we are checking dummy variable not equal to null, dummy variable not equal to undefined and dummy variable not equal to blank. So we are going to see what's the result of this condition. As you can see, this condition returns dummy variable is null or blank. Now we are going to change the value of this dummy variable. Now we will give a value to this dummy variable as you can see. Now we will run this condition again. As you can see the result is dummy variable has a value. Earlier it was showing dummy variable is null or blank. Now it is showing dummy variable has a value. So now we will see an easy way to do this. I am assigning the value of dummy variable back to blank. Now we will do the magic thing. We have shortened this condition to just a single variable. As you can see the results are same. Now we will assign back the value test. Even now the condition is working well. So this way you can avoid using a long condition and put this particular condition in place. Just write the variable name in the if condition and you will be good to go. Now let's come to using string variables in arithmetic operations. Suppose we have a variable in which there is an integer value but that value is in string. So normally what we do is we simply use parse float or parse int just to parse that value and then we can use it but there is a simple solution to that as well. Let me show you how. So this is my developer console once again and here I'm taking a variable with the name of integer where and I'm gonna assign this a value suppose for example let's take it a 10 a value 10 if I'm going to perform any arithmetic operation in this variable I need to convert it first into an integer as it is now in string variable form now if I don't convert this string variable into an integer the result would be like this so let's take up the case of parsint this way we can simply perform this operation but there is a simple way now instead of using parsint we can just place a plus sign yes just a plus sign in front of the variable and javascript will automatically interpret it as an integer value so let's do it now let's see the results see that's the same result that we were expecting so this way we can really simplify our arithmetic operations now let's see how we can set a default value to a variable suppose we want to assign a value of a variable to another variable in that case if the value of variable that we are assigning is null or blank then in that case we can assign a default value to the resulting variable let's see how this can be done let's take a variable named first variable here I'm assigning it a value blank now let's take another variable named result now we will be assigning the value of first variable into the result variable the syntax would be like this 
result equal to first variable now if you want to set a default value to the result variable in case first variable has no value or maybe undefined or null in that case we can simply put or operator that we normally use in various languages and assign a value after the or operator now if the value of first variable would be null or undefined in that case the result variable will get the value that we have assigned after the or operator so for our case the value of result variable would be test now suppose if this first variable had some value in that case let's run this again in that case the result will be the value of the first variable so this way you can set default value to a particular variable now is the turn of our fourth and last javascript hack that is ternary operator in javascript we can perform if else operation in a single line and that can be done by using ternary operator so let's have a look what exactly is ternary operator suppose we have a variable named result let's declare this variable with the blank value now if you want to put some if else condition to set the value to this result variable we need something normally what people do they put if else condition and in multiple lines they perform the operation but now with using the ternary operator we can do it simply just have a look at this line here this part is the condition that we might have placed in if condition this condition returns true or false after that if the value of this condition is true then the value in the true part is assigned to the result variable and if the value of this condition is false in that case the value in the false part get assigned to the result variable so let's take a live example here let's take another variable i'm naming this variable as index let's assign this variable with zero now i'm gonna check in result variable whether the value of index is zero or not so in this case we have already assigned the value as zero now after putting this condition if the value of index equal to zero then the result variable should have one as a value otherwise it should have a zero value so now let's see what's the value of result it's showing one as the value now suppose if i change the value of index to minus one now if we run this condition again then the value of the result variable is zero so this is very simple with using ternary operator you can avoid using if and else condition so this is all from our site if you have any suggestion query do write to us stay tuned to cheesycode.com